Hello everyone, this is Synth K here, back with another round of Golf Foot. As usual, I downloaded a, uh, or brought up a map, a random map from, uh, from ones that I've downloaded and played in the past. This one is called Westerbury Village, 18 holes. Um, I don't recall the name on it, I don't recall the course, so we'll see um, how it goes once we start playing it. <clears throat> so let's get a shot at it and see how we go. And we start out with jumping out of the course. Uh, is this going to be another one of those where I'm just struggling, getting in the right amount? There we go. Can I get a two? Can I get the angle just right on this? Let's see. I, I got it. Okay. That was an improvement for the first hole. Huh. Left or right? Which is better? I want to think left. That's why I was, I was worried if I went right, I'd go into that uh, gap there. Oh, it's further over. Should have looked first. Uh, this uh, straight up uh, looks like it's up there. It's, don't know how hard I'm supposed to go, but maybe not quite that hard. That was pretty close, though. So. And this is supposed to be a part two. I guess if you land right on it, you'd work. Yeah. Oh, okay. I did get the two. Looks like... Always word at these ones that I'm going to go with the wrong angle and fly off the course. Ah, I just didn't hit hard enough there. Oh, and there's a hole in front, too. I didn't see that. Come on, come on, come on, really? And too hard over the top, Pip. Oh, this is a par three? Okay, well, it looks like uh, I don't have to worry about falling off on the front edge. I think I can get par on this one. So what do we got here? Bounce up into the shoot. Bounce up and land to the left of it? I don't know. Gosh. I go. Oh, come on! You know, if that was a uh, drop hole that just went down, it would have gone right in it. Oh boy. Jump, nope, not jumping the... Where am I supposed to go? Those are empty. Um, right over there. Okay, I'm supposed to... That's odd. That's gonna be tricky. Okay, not too bad. Might even be able to get par. Might even get a birdie, almost. Okay. 
Sometimes on the courses, the big trick is just trying to figure out where you're supposed to go. <clears throat> now, I'm not going to get a par, but I should be able to get a bogey. like that. That's still part two. Okay. Okay, it worked. Jump up or around? I'm going around. I was hoping that would bounce me in. Well, it just wasn't quite the right angle, but it still got a par. One of these days, I will get good enough at mastering those bends like that where I can do this in one shot. I could even do it straight in one shot. Oh, this is going to be fun over here. Oh, Ken. This is going to be tricky. Look at that. You got to just barely get over that uh, hump, so you're rolling down it. There we go. Even there it bounced a little bit. Wow. Okay, up and around. I never know how to do these kind. Let's see if I can get over. Let me get over there. Get over there. Good, good. That's what I was trying to do. At least that way I'm not trying to work against the curve of it and everything. Okay, so this is going to be another one. You just barely got to get over it. Or else you do that. Yeah, a little harder. Definitely harder. <laughs> Come on. Oh, these ones always get to me. There we go. Only took me ten strokes, jeez. Oh, well that was luck. Come on, catch it, catch it, catch it. Oh really? Wow. This hole definitely falls on the frustrating side. Hey, eh? may even DNF on it. Oh, come on. I got it on the first time, and then it drops me off to the side. Okay, how about this time? At least drop me on the course. Look at 
that. I'm sorry, this this qualifies as a uh, poorly designed hole when it does that twice in a row. Maybe the right side's better. I don't know. See, look at that. It goes on the right side, but it pushes it in the left there. Ran out of strokes. What was my stroke limit? Okay, this one, do I try to go straight for? I'm not sure how the best way to do this. Oh, come on. Why? Oh, it's set to 15 strokes. Geesh. I should have set that higher. Okay, well, 18, I only got a bogey on it, so. So, wow, what do you think about that one? Um, that was tough. That was the last uh, 15, 16, 17 are tough. Um, you know, the first part of it I liked. Yeah, the pars were a little bit low on it, I think. But, man, those, la those three there towards the end just are... Those are killer ones. So, I... My own personal rating for this would be fairly low. Um, I'll go back and see what I had on there. I would guess probably somewhere about a 5 or 6 out of 10. Um, that whole 16 where you finally get it in the, the, the pipe, but then it throws it off to the side, that's... I don't know. To me, that's just a, 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 a poor design. It shouldn't be doing that it should be dropping you on the course um then then less the goal of it was to frustrate the heck out of the players but anyhow sometimes you get good courses sometimes you get ones that aren't quite so good and, or i shouldn't call them good courses and bad courses there are courses that i like and courses that i don't like i usually don't like the ones that are you know, like that okay i've gone on and on enough about that anyhow i hope you had a good time uh, watching me here playing and struggling a little bit and in the future soon we'll be back with another game of golf it we'll see what that one will turn up as so till then be sure and take care bye